Hi everyone, my name is Matt Rode. I'm the Chief Marketing Officer for Reflection. Today we're going to be explaining a test. Now, this one we're really excited about because what we originally did was program something called Go No Go, where essentially touch the green lights, don't touch the red lights. But what we found was that athletes would be flinching at the red lights, but not actually touching them. We were annoyed that that wasn't giving us any data, so we actually added something pretty clever. These two blue lights here are home bases. So when I put my fingers on them, they'll light up yellow, indicating that the test is able to begin. So the way that works though, is that by keeping my hands on these fingers, it allows us to measure at what point do we flinch or jump and actually respond and react to the light. So not only does this allow us to actually measure when someone screws up, but it also allows us to further break down reaction time within someone's uh, ability. So being able to know that after a light appears, how long did it take your brain to process that information and actually just lift your hand off that light? It's called latency time. And then we can measure from the time you lift your hand to the time you actually hit the light, or motor time. Altogether, you get a completed reaction time and this is one of the most valuable cognitive functions of uh, brain health and actually just brain uh, safety. So that's Go No Go. Um, take a look at the blog to actually see the results, a, a screenshot of them, and what they look like and what they mean.